Hello, ladies, shins, and deformed monstrosities. Welcome to the as yet unnamed mountain of despair. Let's beat up one of our colonists. Because Lisa Hike is too damn stubborn, wants to go destroy our stuff. This is inadmissible. Let's go to where she's going and punch her in the head until she sees reason. I was like, look, there's one thing. If you want to destroy a few conduits in your place, you're literally going into the storage room and destroying things. Did you have any idea the explosions you can cause in this place? We have to stop it. So, and she's going to fight back. She's going to create some problems here. Why, why are you even going to attack? If you go and literally go and destroy the camp fuel, I'm going to be so pissed. <laughs> he just punch in the head. Holy crap, she is going straight for the camp fuel. Do you have any idea the disaster that this can cause? Don't do it. Don't. We should trash. Stop doing it. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> I was I was about to lose my shit. Probably one more hit would have make it explode. <laughs> it's like, oh, and now she's gonna hate everybody. Let's see. Blargo, banana, F and Damas. How much do you hate them now? <laughs> Harm me, minus fifteen. Oh, well, she already didn't like the creepy breathing. Blargo like their relationship. Not going to be fixed anytime soon. And Nostra Epidemus also beat her up real good. Look, it's just the way that this cookie has crumbled. This psychic drone, I mean, it's not even uh, affecting Hike, is it? Because it was for males. So she was going to be violent no matter what. This is a problem. We need to fix this problem. Let's take a look of all the... Oh, Ragman is still drafted. Is anybody else drafted? No, everything's fine. Take a look at these. Uh, minus 22 psychic drone is just outrageous. That's just stupid, man. It's absolutely awful. But there's not really... Ah, uh, yeah, we can l quickly make a Cybernaw somewhere. That will remove a minus 4 for everybody. The neural supercharge, that ain't gonna happen anytime soon. Grief in Impressive Bedroom, Intense Pain. Yeah, the, the only real thing that I can do something about is the the religious idol. That's about it. I don't want to build it somewhere that is not going to be permanent. So where would the, our idols and effigies, where should they be erected? Probably somewhere around back here. I want to have this space available to expand the freezer is need if need be mm. let's start digging for a start digging for a temple so we wanted storage plus storage plus manufacturing back here there's going to be living spaces down here let me plan them real quick all right, how you like it? About 15 dwellings planned ahead. Not going to be dug just yet. We want to dig out. This is the, going to be a power generation room, hopefully before the batteries drain. And this is going to be our temple. The most elaborate, beautiful temple that you have ever conceived. Starvation, grave digger. Please, why are you starving? Are there no meals? Ah, oh, that's right. T-Rose, our cook, is now currently eating all the food. So maybe... Erica Dawson, please. You're hunting. Let me uh, remove you from hunting post-haste. Because we need you to cook immediately. So go and do the cooking. No? No? You, you don't want to cook, huh? They have no... There's no food because obviously... I have not set up the butchering of the creatures. Do forever. So, uh, mistakes. Mistakes have been made. You will think that I don't have 700 plus hours in this game. Look, it's, it's difficult, okay? Building up a new, a new establishment. It is a giant pain in the ass. It is perhaps the most, I wouldn't call it tedious. It is a challenging experience to 
recreate a, an advanced settlement from absolute zero, like going into a completely virginal area. Lisa Hike, how are you doing? Where are you? Where are you? You're just healing up from your enormous beating. <laughs> you poor bastard. Equip your uranium mace. You just gotta go over there and put it on. Days on crack like vacuum, that's fine. We like dazes. Dazes are fine. Don't destroy my stuff, sad wonder. <laughs> it's alright. It's okay to get, you know, the harmless type of mental breaks. I am done with that extreme break risk of great on great Divir Erica Dawson getting some meat over there. Okay, this is plenty of food. This is a great pile of food. I believe ready for oh she has the mining command but uh, unfortunately she's just sadly babbling to herself so not the most uh not the greatest time wanderer joins left you <laughs> what <laughs> what are you an idiot have you seen the disaster that we have going on right now a shelter child named Lefia has arrived and wants to join the colony she's willing to contribute but she will not leave voluntarily Claiming to have nowhere else to go. You can choose to turn her down and send her away. However, your colonists will be disturbed at sending someone away in need. They will not be disturbed. Don't worry about it. But, you know, it is a completely... A completely free new colonist. It's going to be, you know, diversity of thought and all that stuff. But I am somebody that welcomes everyone with open arms. If nothing else, we can just eat her brains. Glefia. Am I going to be extremely disappointed just now? Am I about to be super mad that I took you in? No, but you're actually pretty decent. A recluse night owl, though. What is recluse? The fewer people in... Ah, that's gonna be annoying. But a night owl is pretty good. I uh, really expect a complete trash person. But Lefia is decent enough. Let me just uh, put her on hikes schedule right there and she can uh, do some work if nothing else she can haul some garbage around she likes to doctor you're going to be doing childcare at some point <laughs> i don't know when it'll happen but you know if nothing else you're good you're going to be a researcher for the time being though you can just do hauling and cleaning because boy do we need it do we have a uh, the home zone expanded there you are might as well get everything else in the home zone and this as well. Let's m create some uh, cam fuel power generators. Mm, put them right along this wall. I do like to space it because the game has a tendency of disallowing crisis of belief of Pat Herner. <laughs> He's as lame. He'll believe what I tell him to believe. 50%. That is like literally a nothing burger basically it's a free catharsis isn't it no no he doesn't get catharsis out of that so he just gets sad and doesn't believe in my my incredible ideology anymore as if i need you to as if i give a crap okay put that bed over there i can't believe i hadn't hold it yet Ooh, watching tv may be a, a big a big boon for my fellas for now, we can just install it right there. Maybe eating without a table is also pretty bad. Let me just uh, put it... I mean, this will consume a lot of power, though. Let me create some furniture. Let's get those tables going. They will be garbage wooden tables, but better than nothing. And that is uh, the most literal statement that I got for you. Better than nothing. That is where we're settling at. Put that there and put some stools around it. People can no longer complain about eating without a table. Freaking baboons. Got some plenty of wood, right? 500, that's good. Um, what else do I want to do? Put in the, the TV. Put it right there. So people that have dinner can watch TV. We should have the the power generation going pretty fastly get this mind out where ragman no longer wandering sand that's great do we have meals we have 13 meals let me make sure that there is 
more than 20. There, 30 available. Uh, we, we will eat whatever. We don't really care. Break Soul is so sad. Why is he Break Soul so sad? We have such a great place going on here. With catharsis, Break Soul is just utterly bereft. <laughs> it just sucks, man. Uh, it'll probably just turn violent at some point. Truly upsetting. But what you want me to do about it? Is there maybe something else that we can install? I don't, I don't see anything. Uh, that near disaster with Hike. Let's make sure that we contain the, the camp fuel somewhere that is not going to completely obliterate the everything that I own. Let me say camp fuel. Clear everything. Camp fuel priority important. There you go. And eliminate camp fuel for here. Let's take that out. All right. Get that time going forward. We have so much trash. Gave up. Break Soul has given up on this community. He has decided to leave and pursue a better life elsewhere. You can try to arrest him as he leaves. Otherwise, you may still see him again someday. Uh, he's still inside. Let me put you in a room. <laughs> you will not leave. Nobody can leave the cult of the Blargonites. How dare you? After everything that we've done for you, you're one of the OGs. You're Hike's brother. Let's see. We're, I guess for now, we'll put you in the butcher's area. Let me uh, put the sleeping spot right here. Everything's falling apart. It's all right. It's just growing pains. By the way, Lefia is a, is a bona fide full member of this colony just went from zero to nothing gotta give her some kind of gun though uh, do i even own any guns i think i sold all the surplus that i had so all she can do is just throw dirt at my enemies unfortunately i guess for now you can equip that plasteel sword but you know don't don't, don't cut yourself with it you are utterly incompetent at it but let's give her a name her name is Filthy Heathen because she is no not yet part of the cult. By the way, Hike, do you have no you don't have available the conversion tools? Uh, no longer hiding. Great stuff, great stuff. <laughs> the slave is no longer hiding. Uh, this sad wonder though. This is not going well. It's alright, we're going to to make it. Don't worry about it. Unfortunately, I did not make this symmetrical and that's going to bother the crap out of me the cyber gnaw is just not properly aligned mm, i guess i can just do something like this expand everything to the side but that's not gonna work though Ooh, the lack of symmetry is gonna bother me forever let me uh, rethink this room I think I did it right. I, my brain has been broken trying to figure out the proper symmetry here. Been pretty damn stupid. Oh, break soul. You absolute buffoon. I risked the shit out of you. What? Oh, I put it for slaves instead of prisoners. My bad, my bad. Arrest! That sucks because he is like literally not part of the colony anymore. So. You have to basically convince him again to get in, get back into the colony. Prisoner. 19 resistance. Bruh. <laughs> ah, recruit. Upsetting. Upsetting indeed. But what do you want me to do about it? Ancient danger has been discovered. Ephendamus going a little too close there. He is hunting this buck. Ephendamus. Are you going to shoot these boomalopes and make a complete disaster? I look forward to it. Uh, I guess we can maybe watch it. Okay, he has decided that he's done hunting. He sucks to hunt out there in the cold and the rain. So just, just go back to what you were doing. Which is just eating. The power is not great right now. Eventually, 
how about you make this chem fuel generator? We kind of need it. We need it dearly. Make that power conduit right there. Finally, eating with tables. Let, let's make some wall lamps. This is just wonderful. What we have now, finally, the psychic drone is ending. Holy crap, brother. Uh, we are not able to put lamps on the walls. It's just incredible. Truly an amazing technology, innovation. <laughs> These break rates. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Let's uh, get that ideogram and put down. Actually, I cannot do it just yet. This is the, display, the space that is going to occupy. Beautiful and centralized. Freaking steel all the damn places, slowing everything down. Meg, when are you going to be stopping with the psychotic wandering? The thing about psychotic wandering is one of the worst uh, non violent things that you can get because it can end at any point in the future. It can take forever for that shit to be over. Uh, okay, we are. We do have a nice freezer over here. We don't really need the hem hemogen impacts, but. Oh, man, Break Soul is going to be so sad. <laughs> anyway, I really should prioritize. That reminds me. Should prioritize having a freaking prison going on. Which also reminds me, I wanted to have a hospital slash prison somewhere around here. So uh, this plan for the dwellings may need to be altered. Or we can have it over here. I guess we can have it over here. Let's create... Let's create a prison. What I can do is maybe have the prison of me. Ah, he can just endure right there. Just screw him. He gave up on this colony. Well, I gave up on it. my humanity. Treating him properly. Treating him humanely. I don't give a crap. He gets what he freaking deserves. Anyway, let's have our prison here and they will be has gotten food poisoning because of an incompetent cook. I thought for sure it was a uh, dirty environment. That means there's four damn meals that are tainted. All right. Mm, prison slash hospital. I do like to put them together. For now, though, let's see. We can put the hospital there so the prison... The hospital will be somewhere around here. You want something like this. I always like to shape it in an interesting way, the hospital. That's okay, I guess. Is that interesting? Does this seem like an interesting shape to you? I don't give a crap. Good enough. And then... Bed, bed, prison entrance. I like the prisoners needing to go through the hospital to be able to escape. Actually, I should make it where it's deep, right? Cancel that. Uh, so that way we can utilize that area better. So uh, let's do it like shelves over there or something and the prison should be right there. Right there. That's a decent prison. Getting a little too deep in the weeds here. This is just awful. That is a ton of chem fuel that we have piled up. Very nice. The resistance went down pretty decent considering that he's in, in a hole in the ground. Unfortunately, I cannot butcher things anymore because it's inside the prison. No longer wandering. Hey, nice. Go eat something, Meg, and start digging some more because we really, really need it. This TV is probably what's really draining my batteries. Thankfully, though, we have this amazing generation going on. And once the power conduits are built, it should be fine. By the way, then we have the Prep Neuralink opportunity. I would love to, to, to do it. I really want... Yeah, that's right. We had this trade, but ugh, it's, there's no way I'm going to be able to have that clock. Well, <laughs> what the... <laughs> There's a fire outside my door. Quickly, before my boomalopes catch fire, everybody needs to put, that, put this fire away. What the hell, brother? What the freaking hell? 
Everybody back out there. Who? What's wrong, fathead nerd? Food poisoning, that's right. Ah, you'll be fine. Don't be such a pussy. Uh, get that dog out, please. Uh, we need this new prison. Everything is awful. Zone. Expand the home zone. We need some more cleaners that are going to happen. And eventually this entire thing will be home zone. So why not put it on? It makes no difference while it's not dug out. So it doesn't quite matter. Uh, there's a weird, uh, strange signal. What's this about? Your colonies all feel a psychic message echoing. It's a signal from an inhuman twisted mind that was left behind somewhere far away. You can focus on the signal and echo it back. But you can't tell what will happen if you do. I know we are ready to accept this mysterious quest. I really would like this, though. I mean, 610 cloth. Fire. Yes, indeed. Zone. Really. This damn fire, brother. It drives me crazy. Fire expanded like this. Do I even have... Uh, maybe I have... Hmm... Oh, oh, you left something. Some of that fire foam. Put it away. All right. What the hell was that about? How did that fire get started? And now, now it starts raining. Stupid piece of garbage. Major break risk. Going to crack like that, eh? He's just hungry. He's a hungry boy. I wish I could tell the tunneler, hey, maybe dig here instead, but... Everything is high priority. It's just a matter of uh, what fire do you have to put out first? Well, first put out the literal fire in the fields. Wow, we actually have no major break risks anymore because everybody has already broken. Filthy heathen. Believe oh, finally we can name this. She believes she can take the massive war bed. Filthy heathen. This belongs probably like to T-Rose or somebody. I will give it to Mary Crack like that and get a little bit of a mood boost. What will we call this place? T-Rose believes that it needs a name. What shall we name it? I think this place can take no other name but the Mountains of Madness. Surely nothing bad will happen. With that name, it's just an auspicious name. Let me put the zone clear, the filth area, uh, no filth in my temple, no filth in my prison. Unfortunately, it does prevent the elephants from hauling these rocks. And let me expand this to have more rocks outside. It's such a pain in the ass to have just a, a, a dumping zone. It's always a massive problem. If you want to move it, it takes forever to haul it elsewhere. But what you gonna do about it? There's nothing I can do about it. Just haul that garbage away. It's take forever to dig a hole in the ground. Please don't find steel. Please don't find components. Just regular old sandstone. So I can get this damn hole dug out. Very nice to have this done here though. Uh, you, you need... You need a proper name. I think a good name would be Rock... Hard driller. Oh, drill? What the hell do you mean? Rock hard driller. There you go. Excellent. Now go over there and dig over here. Oh, that's why you're not digging because I did not give you the command to drill. Uh, user error. Programmer error. Unfortunately, the driller is soon going to run out of energy. Uh, we do need the, this conduit's being built. Oh, do we maybe not have steel? It is very possible. We have no steel. Mm-hmm. That'll, that'll do it. Absolute idiot. Let me just mine. Uh, we're going to mine this out. Uh, this will eventually mine out. Don't worry about it. Eventually it will happen. Banana, how about you... Reserved for prisoners? What do you mean? It's inside the prison, but I don't want it to be in there. It makes no sense for it to be reserved for prisoners. That's so silly. Do I need to, like, deconstruct this? <laughs> haul it? And then... Because I don't want it to rot, you know? How about it is refrigerated? 
kinda. Because it's cold as hell in this prison. Oh, but now we have a hole right here. Just quickly build... Quickly build doors to this place. We could even maybe build an actual bed? Nah. We could just put a human leather bedroll for break soul right there. Maybe dig out the steel, that would be great. Filthy heathen! You literally took the best bet possible and you are this much of a piece of trash? You disappoint me. Uh, Meg, how about you quickly go out and get, our some, get us some steel? It's uh, get out of control here. Fathead Nerd is back. Finally, we have a proper slave. Oh, yeah, finally we got that steel. I didn't realize that we were out. No wonder these conduits are not being built. Oh, yeah, everything is now doing what it should be doing. We're doing okay. We're basically barely scraping by. But it's starting to be, it's starting to stabilize. Still bad times. Poor rock hard driller has run out of energy. Let me get that ideogram properly centered. Gorgeous. We need that. Something I would like is, uh, you know, a material that is not wood. But unfortunately, I don't have rocks just yet. But you know what? You know what? Because we are fancy, we can make it out of plasteel. Not not a door, you buffoon. Let me request expire. Yeah, okay, that's fine. Um, put that door right there on a plasteel door. It's super fancy. It's the freaking temple to the cyber now. We have to splurge. It's a requirement. Hey, I can now convert again. Thank you for telling me. I appreciate that. We are invested in getting freaking geezer into our colony. But I really would like filthy heathen. Like, she is more of a priority, I feel. Geezer. The geezer. Where is it? Oh, but she's in the break. So, might as well continue on the geezer. Convert the geezer. Wake up. Well, <laughs> it was bound to happen, wasn't it? It was bound to happen. Blargo and t -Rose, they have been at each other's throats for quite a while. Where are you? Where are you? Uh, I mean, he likes her well enough. But t -Rose, she's she's got a bone to pick with his ways. Who's going to win this fight? Just bashing each other. They, there was no winner. There was no winner. It was just, <laughs> just unleashing the violence. At least they do get a catharsis. One of them at least does. Probably Tiro's, yeah, catharsis. She was the one that started the, the fight. Well, that is just unfortunate. It is time. It is time to do something about the signal. It just, it has been warming itself inside my mind. I need... To accept this, you can always all feel a psychic message echoing. It is a signal from an inhuman twisted mind that was left behind somewhere far away. You can focus on the signal and echo it back, but you can't tell what will happen if you do. The whispering, I cannot take it anymore. We need to answer this signal, even if it may cost us our sanity. All right, the power is finally being stored into the batteries. This setup obviously is not permanent. This is a bad setup, but that also reminds me, we should have, you know, a actual clo enclosure of our, of our place. Let's make the door out of wood because it will not be plasteel eventually. Mm. Okay, this is now for prisoners. We can now destroy this one. Oh, man, I did the venison break. It probably broke. Poor Blargo. Got <laughs> himself beaten by the person that he was trying to woo all this time. All that time ago. Just take the bed breaks all there, Meg. There you are. Man, it sure takes quite... It's quite a trek to go to the freezer, huh? Maybe it's a good idea to maybe make a... Make a bit of a shortcut. 
do something like this and an opening over here like so that enables also the mechs to go in through here you know i don't think that's a bad idea i cannot destroy this whole thing i do need to leave one block we'll build a, co uh, a column somewhere in there uh this cyber knot needs to be created buddy research bench meditation spot there's so much stuff that still needs to be done but i am glad that things are starting to look up do we have enough power i think that is plenty of power we're doing okay ah i'm starting to you know be able to think about things that are completely immediate it rains a lot in this area huh? rains a ton okay so now this is probably enclosed we have a proper only cyber no disrespected of course it is being disrespected it is in a freaking dark hole in the ground keep expanding this dumping zone mm, we want lights we want columns structure do i want to make them out of plastic yes i do you may call it a waste I call it honoring our holy symbols. So the pews are going to go like, like here and here. Uh, maybe just make like two. Uh, that's where I usually put the. Let's put the columns on the sides, I guess. We'll put it like so. One, two, three, and four. There eventually built now what else is are you there's been disrespect about oh that old floor is such a pain i don't even have a, a workshop to make rocks yet what the hell are we going to floor it with i guess steel we can make it out of steel and it is it, it is in keeping with what we've been doing let's just put paved for now we'll replace it with something nicer for now we can just put it a nice paved floor so that way the cyber knot is not disrespected simple meal incompetent cook well that is unfortunate indeed but how was the wildlife <laughs> freaking fire brother um we probably want to hunt some more of this garbage hunt the donkeys please put it away there you are well well done well done they call treatment on Blargo, but he can just tend himself. Why is he not tending himself? What are you, stupid? Doctor Kirva, no medicine. Just uh, pray, tend to yourself, Blargo. This is just a disaster. Make sure your bruises are properly tended to. Uh, so what's going on with this strange signal? Nothing has happened so far. It's just uh, a thing that is gnawing at the back of my mind. Okay, so that's great. This barracks is a disaster. I hate it. But it's not quite a, the priority right now. Let me just get some extra wooden doors. Uh, we can just leave all this open. Just eh. We'll just leave the doors open. That's what we'll do. Probably we will also want some extra. Let's make a fancy, beautiful ornate door hey, it takes 50 gold this needs to be made out of a, a proper material well this needs rescue huh probably the we got metal probably fat nerd, nerd yeah the, the food poisoning nobody cares about this idiot what's he doing oh that's right in the patch <laughs> people can crawl <laughs> when they get down people can crawl slowly it's pretty funny i like it we really need some extra food though are these mushrooms going to be out anytime soon not really that poor bastard is just down completely down for the count uh we don't have uh, any mining scheduled let me make sure i really also need a place to make rocks for now let's dig this hallway And we 
can start digging some rooms. I will be eventually done. Nice, giant, fancy 5x5 five five rooms. Super amazing. And I guess we can just make our rock production area right here. Let's might as well mine out the components. And we'll have shells, we'll have rock production, and then we'll build a wall on the outside. Um, put a entrance right here. Wonderful. Do I have wood though? Probably run out of wood, huh? Let's chop some wood. Chop all that stuff. Probably also should have made a fence at some point. I know they're, they're, they're hitched. They're still not starving, so yeah, they're fine. Meditation spot, major break risk. Filthy heathen is back, huh? But the catharsis, good stuff. Just eat some garbage. And let things continue happening. Slowly, this beautiful temple is taking shape. We really want to have that depraved neural link for a little bit of extra... Extra mood? Break soul? You have a psychic insanity lands on your back? Hopefully, uh, enemies don't use that spontaneously, do they? I hope not. That would be a freaking disaster. What's this? A wall lamp for some reason got uninstalled. What? Why is there a wall lamp on the floor? When did that happen? Oh, because this got mined. I see, I see. I see. Let's put it right there. Finally, our poor tunneler is getting charged. We also need a place for our uh, waste bags. I don't think they have produced any yet. All right. Hey. Cyber not no longer disrespected. We do need some light in this place. I love putting some braziers. Even though they're low tech, they just give you the right ambiance. Very nice. And I don't even know if I want to create the neural link because, you know, the quality is going to be ass. So, oh, that's right. We use Neil sheets instead of. We also don't have a lectern. Uh, furniture. Oh, no, that's ideology. Neil sheet. Make it, of course, out of human leather. Who the hell do you think you're talking to? Um. There's going to be um, probably some kind of sculpture right there. So let's do it like this. Very nice. And then a lectern. They have to be made of wood. Lecterns, you make them out of wood. That's how they work. There you go. Hopefully they will be built before the ritual opportunity passes us by. Built the heathen already working for the colony. Making sure the break soul comes back. You absolute buffoon, I can't believe you betrayed us like this. You were supposed to be one of the OGs, but no. For shame, absolutely atrocious. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, 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 give me those freaking nil pillows. Nil pillows. No, sheets, they're sheets. Fat nerd is back. Break souls, charge lands. It's just awaiting... Usage, certainly nowhere near putting the, this bionic stomach in anybody. It would be a disaster having a, any kind of surgery right now. All right, well, what we need to do instead of continuing spending the, the dump zone, we need to actually, you know, make the, make the place where you can use the damn rocks. Okay, there's the Neil Sheets. Mechanoid Cluster, landing nearby. Welp. That is a fat. I hope those are all walls. Bruh. <laughs> I mean, it's not too bad. This is the main problem. What are you? Defoliator, huh? You're very, very far. Not that far, but... You're far enough that I I'm not terribly worried about you, but... Proximity activator. Countdown activator. We have to come out and kill this thing. There's no way we can just let it be. Thankfully, though, the proximity activator is really not that far. So we can maybe, like, stand right here and start throwing some uh, EMP grenades. And that should take care of this 
quite handily. We'll get really close to this thing or maybe just bash it. It's going to be all right. This first threat that we're facing, it is bad, but not horrible. I do want to take care of it as soon as possible, though. And I guess that will happen in the next episode. I was hoping for some kind of crazy thing to happen, but nothing yet. Nothing yet. It's just whispers being carried in the wind. Echoes ringing for the mountains of madness. They have yet to resolve into real voices, but it's only a matter of time. <laughs>